Hey guys, um, I just wanted to come on here and talk about my feelings, um, because Lord knows I've got a lot of them. Um, I think that this week has been a difficult week for many, um, with the new passport restrictions, um, you can definitely feel the divide between people a lot more, um, than you have in the past year and a half, two years of this whole pandemic. Um, it's really evident that the segregation is really beginning to happen. Um, it was really, really shitty. <laughs> um, I think that there's so many different circumstances for people, um, whether they get their vaccine or they don't. And I think that it's really important um, to hold space for differences between people. We've never been good at that throughout all of history. Um, we've never been able to find common ground between differences. And I think that that's one of the worst things about society and about people. Um, it can be the best, it can be the, also the worst because you know we're supposed to have our tribe, we're supposed to have our people. Um, but I also think it comes at a cost because then it's an us versus them mentality. Um, and that's never, ever healthy. Um, I think that everyone is kind of overwhelmed and just over everything to do with COVID. Um, and now it's almost like there's like the elite and there's the second class society, um, that being the vaccinated and the non-vaccinated. Um, and oops, um, I normally never talk about politics, um, especially on my um, business page because I just don't think that there's a place for it here. Um, I think that no matter who you are or what your choices are, um, you have a right and an opinion to your choices and I just don't think that should be taken away from you. Um, I mean, I totally understand those who have gotten their vaccine and those who haven't um, and I think that holding that general middle ground for people to have the choice um, is important because once we take away those choices, it's gonna be a really, really hard world for some. Um, and I just don't think that that's what we all collectively want as a society. I think that we're all inherently good um, and we want others to do well. I mean, I hope. I think. <laughs> I do, anyway. Um, but yeah, I kind of have this feeling of it's just now, not only are we worried about our health um, and our relationships and our livelihood, um, we're now worried about being an outsider or not being invited or included. Um, and I think that that's just not a good way to live. Um, and I mean, I started my whole business on the premise of spreading joy and positivity in this shitty world. Because let's be honest, there's just a lot of shit. Um, excuse my language, but I think that those of us who are the joy spreading ones and the ones who take care of others and are empathetic, we're all kind of getting to our wits end. Um, because like for me, I am a completely neutral stance when it comes to COVID and vaccines. Um, like I completely understand if you do, I completely understand if you don't. And I think that that's a really hard spot to be in right now because it's almost as if society, you either have to be labeled as this or this. And if you're in here, there's no platform for you. There's no like there's not a lot of people who confess that they're in this spot um and it's really kind of sad because it feels like you're alone um like i just want people to be happy and healthy and i think that each person's individual decision it, like they should have their own decision um and i think that we still need to protect others and love others um throughout that but protecting and loving is also setting free and letting them decide for themselves. Um, yeah, I think that it's just been a really rough week. Not gonna lie, today was a breakdown day. I cried a lot um, and I think it was necessary, but 
um, it just gets to a certain point where you have like there's no longer capacity to be able to understand others or to try to be empathetic um, and I think I'm at that point which is really rare for me and I think that maybe it comes a lot sooner for other people um, but being hardened off to the world and to people and to other people's happiness is not a healthy place to be um, and it's really difficult so I'm kind of just putting this out here because I never have really talked about COVID on this page um, ever and it's definitely not going to become a place that it's spoken about often um, but I think that I want to be kind of that person where it's like hey if you're in here between this side and this side there's still a place for you in society it's to be the lover and the healer and the one that encourages and just to be that person that people can say hey I just want an honest opinion or I want to talk about this without feeling judged like we need to have those places for people because right now there's no safe space for anyone um yeah I guess that's what I want to become on this page and just in general in life that's always been my goal to be that person that is understanding um and there's not a lot of people that are willing to take that stance I don't think that are open to anyone um so yeah if you're in that area and you're just really not sure and you're overwhelmed by life and by the shit um I'm with you I don't know how we're gonna get through it but we are there's always been always been something that we've had to deal with as humanity um I mean my great grandpa was in the war my grandpa was in the war we've all had something that shapes us as a society but I think that we can either come out of this very very divided or we can come out of this with an understanding for other people um and maybe I'm just really really hopeful but I really really hope that we do come out of this as a better society um understanding others who are different from us is super important because everyone is different than us um there's not two people the exact same in the world so I think that we need to have that space for others um yeah I think that's really all I have to say I think this has come a lot from like my healing of crying and thinking and feeling today um but yeah just know that you're not alone know that there's people out there who understand you um because we're all different and I think we need to all hold space for each other okay that's all I love you guys no matter who you are or what you've done or your opinions or views or anything I love you all <laughs>